It's been tough for George Abraham to find work nowadays. At 64 years of age, he has been living in Winnipeg for most of his life, but has been struggling to make ends meet and is currently on welfare. I'm going to say, but I'm on welfare now. I'm on welfare now. I don't have enough money to feed the family. George is one of many others in the community that face poverty each day. Approximately 1,400 people experience homelessness in Winnipeg every night. It's not a great situation in Manitoba. Unfortunately, people in need, that number is growing. And people here in Manitoba who are in need, they need our help. George was invited on the street by members of the Iglesia de Cristo to come to an outreach event, joining hundreds of visitors and members who participated in the Iglesia de Cristo's Worldwide Aid for Humanity. I was just walking by the street, and all of a sudden, all of a sudden I was invited here. I was just walking down the street. Then I said, oh sure, I'll go. I'll go. If God, provides, if God wants me to go there, I'll go there. Members all over Central Canada have united in collecting food and goods to help those who are less fortunate, simultaneously in three venues of Winnipeg, Regina, and Lloydminster, so that others, like George Abraham, may have a little help and hope that can go a long way. Oh, it helps, it helps those in need in so many ways, not only in the tangible sense where maybe you need groceries or shelter over your head, but it gives people hope. It reminds them that we're going to take care of each other. The way I felt about uh, this place is I felt a lot of good energy. Oh, I, I felt a lot of good energy and then it, it made me feel good. It made me belong here because it doesn't matter what color you are. We're all brothers and sisters no matter who we are. Reporting from Winnipeg, Central Canada, I am Brother Jeb Javier for the Worldwide Aid for Humanity special coverage.